have anxiety? Do you get anxiety frequently? Same! What of it? We are going to get anxiety together. In fact, actually, no, we're not gonna get anxiety together. We're gonna try our best to not get anxiety. My camera's already getting anxiety just when I point at it. So, stay calm, will ya? There's a subreddit out there called Sweaty Pams. It's dedicated towards uploading stuff that's going to make you sweat your b****s off. And I hate it. It's come up a bunch of times because most of the stuff that's on it has got to do with heights. And you know that your boy turns into a four-year-old toddler when it comes to heights. The knees go weak, the jelly gets loose, and I just can't handle it. I don't like it. Humans aren't supposed to be up that high. That's why you have two legs in the ground and we're not f birds. So welcome everybody to the try not to get anxiety challenge. Let's all get into this together. Let's feel uncomfortable like a good old proper family. Oh, why? Oh, no. Every time with the heights. No, kitty cat, you're not supposed to be out there. I'm sure the cat's fine, but I'm not fine. One small slip, at least you'd probably land on your feet and you'd actually be okay. That cat's well aware that it still has nine lives. A place in New Zealand where you ride down a hill in a go-kart. All right, what's happening? Is this like R-rated Mario Kart? Oh God. Oh God, I like how it said slow down. And none of them are. Oh my god, this is so dangerous. I love it. I fear for the safety regulations in this. Oh my god. That looks like the quickest way to getting a hospital visit. Just sliding down around, hitting the curb, bouncing out over and into the grass, your bones popping out through your knees. I kind of want to try it out though, in all fairness. And you're doing this in shorts! Oh my god, there's not even a... A margin on the side of it. You can just go straight into the grass. You know a bunch of lads went onto this at some point, hammered. And they just did not care. All those signs that said slow down, they were basically going by them going like... Jesus Christ! Oh god, you're at the end of it. Okay. That's not so bad. Okay. Well, I've already failed the challenge. I've been anxious twice now already, okay? <laughs> I forgot that this was supposed to be challenging. Meditate! Everybody, deep breath in! <sighs> not the first time I've had a floppy banana on my face. Oh god, straight into another one. Okay, no, I'm not gonna get anxious on this one. I'm just gonna watch this one dead inside. I'm gonna be dead behind the eyes and not react. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no. Oh, Jesus. What a mad lad. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, always with the heights. Why with the heights? When I went to Japan, I went on to the Tokyo Sky Tree. Just standing up onto it and looking out in the windows, I was already like, Japan is beautiful, but also, no. And then there's a section in the ground that's just opened up and you can walk over and see straight down to the ground. Now, to be fair, the glass is about 14 inches thick. You'd need some lad from Kilkenny with a forehead the size of an ostrich just to headbutt the thing and crack it. I was still terrified. I did not like it at all. I just stood over and I was like, okay, take the picture and go. Is that a bloody killer whale? And you're just riding around on a boomer board. Oh, Lord. You do know that those are the most dangerous thing in the water, right? Those things will eat you. They'll come up behind you. They're not looking at you like, oh, what is that thing? They're like, that's a human and I'm gonna mess with them. I'm gonna go up and I'm gonna nibble their ankles and you're lucky that I'm full. Otherwise, you're going straight into my belly. Oh, jeez. Oh, God! Is he dead? Oh, he has a parachute. Oh, God. And a, and a sweet, slippery, nippled body. Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Oh no! That is not what I want to see! That is horrible! <laughs> that is all of my fears! The human body's not m meant for that! I'm not anxious. I'm not anxious. I'm fine. Alright, I just need to step away for a second to get a drink of water because I'm thirsty. Not because- not because this is bothering me. I'm fine. Alright. I got me some anxiety juice, all right? It's anxiety juice, okay? Every time I get anxious, I take a sip, all right? I'm holding myself accountable for this. This is supposed to be try not to get anxious. 
Try not to get sweaty pants. Try not to sh pants challenge. Again, with the f***ing heights. What is wrong with people? What is wrong with all of you? Some people are like, uh, you're not afraid of the heights. You're afraid of falling. I'm afraid of it all. No sh I'm afraid of falling. I'm afraid of being up there. I'm afraid of falling. I'm afraid of just existing in that space that high up. What's wrong with the rest of you that you're not afraid? I'm lucky that the camera quality is bad. Because otherwise, this would look so much worse. Could you imagine this in IMAX? At this point, it's- I'm not anxious. I'm frustrated. I'm annoyed. <laughs> I'm more annoyed with the people doing these things. Are you strapped in at all? Or are you just- Are you just doing this naturally? Are you freehanding this? Look, you have gloves on. God forbid your hands get burnt. <laughs> oh my god. Are you gonna jump into the plane in wingsuits? Holy crap! Do you think they knew he was supposed to be in there? They're just flying along and they're like, what the f- Who are you? I survived on that one. That one didn't make me anxious. So it's 14-1. One. one to me. Take that, anxiety. What are you gonna do now? Checkmate. Stop it. Just stop it. How? How and why? Not only is this the stupidest thing you could have done, but you brought up a selfie stick at the same time. Nah. You might look at that and go, hell yeah, we're cool, we're respectable. I look at that and I think, no. I'm gonna throw my shoe at you. What are you doing? What are you doing? Do not jump off that bus. Do not jump off that bus. Do not jump off the bus! No! I don't care that you have a parachute! What is wrong with people?! Can't you just like go to the cinema or something? Can't you go to an amusement park? Strapped into something? Can't you just like, run for about 20 minutes? And get the adrenaline going. Why do you have to jump off a bus with a camera strapped to you and a parachute? I don't get it. I will never ever do that. Bungee jumping is about as close as I get to it. You know, maybe I should face my fears. Maybe then I wouldn't get anxious. If I if I went bungee jumping every day for a year, or if I went parachuting, I'd be terrified. But I wonder if I'd get over my fears. Maybe we should do that. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. That's super impressive. Oh god. No. No. How's he flipping it like that? Why are his fingers still attached? Is this going to be like an anime where he stops? Oh, he cut his finger. <laughs> the tip of his finger was cut. I knew you couldn't have gotten away with that, you freak. Oh, okay. I failed on that one. You see, the more of my anxiety juice that I take, the less anxious I feel. That's a surefire way for a slippery slope into alcoholism, and that's a bad message. Put up the disclaimer, okay? Except the guy's not responsible for anything. No. Is that real? No. I'm already bad in planes. If I'm in a plane and it hits a slight bit of turbulence, I'm like, well, it was nice knowing you. You know what? It's it's anxiety already. And then you have to come along and be like, in a plane. The rest of you are getting anxious as well, right? It can't just be me. Please tell me it's not just me. Am I the only one that's afraid of all of this stuff? And afraid of heights? Oh, mother of Christ. Oh, God, that back wheel! Oh, my God! Camera, calm down! I know, I'm I'm just as anxious as you are. Jesus, please tell me they're all, these are all the people who are out of the bus. We had something like that before. I went to Lanzarote. Um... When I was younger, and we went up to onto a volcano somewhere to look and see around. It was super cool. But on the way up there, it was a path like this. In fact, this actually looks like volcanic rock as well. And we were driving up, and it was like right off the edge of a cliff. I swear, it was life and death on that day. I was, I was full sure that I was going to die. And then they parked the bus, and the bus was parked like this. On the side of the hill. It's like this is the hill, and the bus is just sitting on it. And I was like, how is this bus just not rolling all the way down the hill? Well, that's gonna be it for me, lads. That was the try not to get anxiety challenge, and I got anxiety almost 100% of the time watching this. I didn't like it. Not good at all. That made me wildly uncomfortable. Why did I decide to do this to myself? <laughs> smash like if you got an anxious as well. Smash like if you're anxious all the time. Smash like if you just have anxiety in general. Yeah. Why not? Let's- let's turn it into a positive thing. We're all together, we're all here, we're all living on the same planet, and we're all anxious together. It's fine. It's fine, we're still here, we're still fighting, we're still going. Jack Sept, the guy does not condone the use of alcohol to get over anxiety, okay? It was just a joke, it was just a bit. I don't want to see anybody in the comments saying stuff about me. Okay, I'm, I'm very sensitive. But that's gonna be it for me, I'm gonna go meditate for four days up in the Himalayan mountains. Actually, no, that's really high up, I don't want to go there. I'm just gonna go meditate.
Or I, I, I just gotta go meditate in Minecraft and pet my dog. 